Welcome back, one and all, to Might and Magic 6, Mandate of Heaven. Right, in this episode, we're not going to raid this place, because raiding this place is not a good idea. Why? Because we've got better things to do, like look at stones in the middle of a pond. Mm -hmm. Yes, but before we go, we need to get healed. Because healing is special, and it gives you some type of healing properties, so you can last longer, so that means less death, because death is never good unless it's a giant purple beam of death, because if it's a giant purple beam of death, multiple things can happen. Uh-huh. Is what that right? Well, you see, there's a thing called death, I don't know if you've heard of it. You, friend. Um, no. It's, it's, you know, it's a very deadly thing, you know, because it can make you dead. Sounds fatal. It is fatal, because after all, it comes from flying muffins. Uh, uh. Yes. And you see, Kirk is part of it too. How is, how is Starface? I don't know. Where is Starface? Ah, oh, Starface is missing his hands. Let's give him at least oh, one no. hand. Here you go. <laughs> Any more hands? Yes, you can have one more hand. Where's, where's the hand? Oh, I gave you the hand. A bit like, what's the point of mantating Scar? Well, you know, is it Star King or is it Starface? Starface. Starface. Yes. You haven't recorded this in a while, you can probably tell. I'm just making sure he still has his hands so we can eat him later. Yeah, and make sure that it isn't Dark Messiah. Yes! Shush. Need a run? Uh, no, let's fix the prices, so. Well, if Loretta has a new scheme, count me in, but you better get all the companies up. To sign in, yes. We can't rest here. Let's get moving. Oh yeah, you can't rest while you're flying in the air. I thought I just might say that. It would, be awesome it would make sense. It would make sense right. because isn't flying in the, the air what everyone does? Uh, no. There's something right. wrong with you then. Come on, everyone flies in the air and then sleeps. That's what airplanes are for. But the thing is, in the olden days, what you had is rings on your shoes or jetpacks. Yeah, jetpacks. Yes, jetpacks jet on. Yes, jetpacks on your shoes. Uh huh. Are you Kirk? A Gary, a counselor. You are Wanda. What's your portrait? Hello, how are you? Oh. Need a ride? Oh, well, I can fix your price and then wait another twenty-four hours because they won't take me to Silver Cove. Yeah, it's because they're evil. Yes, they're evil because they're purple. Because after all, we all know purple will take over the world in about thirty-seven months' time. Why 37? Mm. Because that's when Armageddon starts. If you didn't know. Is that I when Moose Man comes out? Yes, Moose Man is lo let loose. GPC hates Moose Man. GPC loves Moose Man in a very special way. <laughs> you're not Moose Man, you're a hunter! Mm. Best wait another 24 hours. Need a ride? Ah, you take me to Silver Cove. horses. Okay. Now let's go and look at a pond in the middle of a lake. Let's see if you've got anything I good. I think it's closed. It not closed if you just wait by the door until someone unlocks it. How you doing? It. How you doing? I'm doing fine. You've got a chain of mana. Recovery. Recovery? Increases retail. Ooh. A fancy hat of defense. Holy <laughs> jeez. That's a lot of armor class. That's a pimp hat. It is a pimp hat. It's the best pimp hat ever. Who's missing? Okay, who is missing the armor class? You're missing the armor class, and you have a cold resistance hat. How you you should have the pimp hat. <laughs> Come back. Come on, it's eleven. Eleven plus. That's a bloody broken hat. <laughs> now you're a pirate, huh? Actually, suits her. It does, but kind of off coloring. Mm. Maybe have a different coloring. Like a bit of orange because for some reason she's wearing an orangey thing and she's got a green cloak. Why green? Because apparently elves are known for the greenness. Nature, I guess. I don't know. Mm. Beats me. Beats me too. Anyway, let's go and look at these stones. Stones are fun. You may have recognized this place from when I actually got my Lionheart sword. Can't do it. Oh, wait. It's not. Let's wait until tomorrow. Is that a poor man's Stonehenge? <laughs> yes, it is. Anyway, you just be quiet and li see what actually happens. Nice to see you. 
Welcome to the ceremony of the sun. Stand ye in the circle of life, and face to the north, where no shadows stretch before thee. Meditate on this truth. Money is everything. I have no truer a friend than money. Huh, just kidding. Now, close your eyes and meditate as you stand in the center of the world. And time for just this one sublime moment. Open your eyes. I hereby promote all druids to great druids, and all non-druids to honorary druids. Fading away. Wow, that was special. We had a giant floating head talking to us that happened to be the rule of the place. So she has telepathy, I guess. Scary. Yes. And I believe we can all level up now. Yes. Except from you, because you have to be awkward. <laughs> Very awkward. Yeah. It's not mostly because she keeps getting knocked out. Shh. Um, so, what do we have to do now? Well, I think we uh, be, might be best if I can see if I can get Destroy Undead. Because that dungeon we were in, we kind of had undead in it. And we need to be anti-undead by having something of light. So let's go into the light guild. Oh, it happened to be closed. What time is it? Wait five more hours and it shouldn't be. Light, the magic of good. Light, the magic of good and evil. Yeah, he really does sound evil. He does. He's wearing purple, and he has a shiny face. Destroy on... Mm. Oh, oh, that's expensive. What's your magic? You have... only. You can only cast that once, but it does do a massive amount of damage. What can I sell? Uh, I can I sell know. that. Where is that? Nice. Oh, give that to her. What's that? Oh, that's just a belt. Doesn't do anything. I think I might keep it actually for mm. a later opportunity. Because belts are actually quite hard to come by, as you probably noticed. We can get rid mm -hmm. of that. Uh -huh. uh, you can keep that for enchanting. Let's see, let's enchant it right now. What did it turn into? Did it turn into anything special? A ring of might. Oh, ten might. Wow. Yeah, that's pretty good. Who do you think deserves it more? Uh. Probably the main melee fighter. Hey, hey, look, I got a new fancy shiny ring. It's made of gold, you know. It's enchanted. It makes me feel like Arnold. <laughs> oh, wait, I was saying stuff, wasn't I? Yes. <laughs> yeah. I got distracted by shiny things. Oh, aren't you always getting distracted by shiny things? Yeah, it, it's like a disease with me. Or a curse. No. Yeah, it's a curse from an amulet, you see. Uh-huh. It's why you know, let me see, what I mean am I wearing? Let's see. Yeah, you see? It's a claw, it's got something shiny in the middle. Hide his weapons in the land. It's purple, so it's evil. Quick, roll a save. <laughs> For a saving throw. Uh Might, the magical good. Uh let's see. You! You can get this for very cheap. It's money now. Money is kind of gonna be a little bit useless. After we reach a certain level, that might be soon as well. Okay. Well, I actually won't be useless because I'm just thinking. I think after we actually clear out most, I think after all of us get promoted, it's going to be kind of easy to get money because we haven't got that money. <laughs> we haven't got that much money to spend. No, there's not much we can spend. There we go. I can speak. I swear. I am English. Welcome aboard. You can take me there. I don't want to go there. Uh, town portal. You fail. Do it again. Why am I back here? No. <laughs> I really can't wait until I get master town portal. I really can't. Cause yeah. That's going to be really nice to get a hold of. So what does Master Town Portal do? You can teleport anywhere and at any time. Well, anywhere uh, it's got a fountain in the middle of the place. Huh. You don't it's teleport like into the fountain, do you? Yes, you do. In some cases, I think. I believe. I don't know. Stop staring. Why? Stop staring at me. Need a ride? Hitch up the horses. Now we're going to go back into that place and... 
We can go we got a very powerful destroy undead spell. Apparently it does sixteen points of damage plus a one D six um damage per skill in light magic. Hmm. And it only works on undead, so it's gonna be quite useful. Yes. Get those evil spectres. <laughs> and get those evil spectres and anything monstrous in that place that happens to be a giant and undead. Uh-huh. That's not good. Nothing giant or undead is going to happen. No. Well, maybe something undead because it is a place of undeadness. Yes, undeadness is a word now. I invented it. I'm special <laughs> like that. And I think as soon as we go in, I think I might stop the recording and then start up another one. Mm-hmm. Ah. Shame there's no zombies in there, or you could go on a killing spree. I could, I could, yeah. Be Hell's Janitor! <laughs> <laughs> uh, sadly, yeah. there is no zombies in Might and Magic 6. I think oh. there is My Magic 7. Don't quote me on it. I think My Magic 7 and, my t and the previous My Magic are the only one that has it. Huh. So, yes. Zombies are always fun. Yeah, they are fun. Anyway, I'm going to stop the recording here, and I'll see you all later. And by then, we shall explore this place, which happens to be a giant labyrinth. For there, there might be a minotaur in. Who knows? So I'll see you later, and goodbye. Goodbye.